This is an automated material hoist I built for my treehouse, but it's been slowly dying because it's only powered off this one battery. So my plan is to take the solar panel and cut the plug off, screw this piece of wood on, blend it in, attach the solar panel, and I'm gonna see if I can feed this wire all the way through the tube. I failed to get the wire through, so I ended up just running it down the top, which I don't like, but I did try to tie a nail to the end of a string and feed it through and suck it down the tube with this, but, th but then that happened and the magnet got stuck. Come on! Ugh. Anyway, I did get it hooked up and this flashing blue light tells us that the battery's charging. And that solar panel is specifically meant to trickle charge the battery without overcharging it. Now the cool thing is, I can move the solar panel around to get into the sun, just like this. Now I want to try something that could be really cool if it works. You see, both of these remotes control the functions on the crane, but what if we could combine it all into this remote? According to the instructions, you need to hold this button, press this one four times, press and hold this button, then press this button, and then let go. So what I just did is copy the signals from those two remotes into this one, and since both the winch and the actuator run off the same frequency, I was able to put it all on one remote. So now we have both up and down and in and out on the same remote. Now I already don't like about this remote is that there's a delay. Yeah, like a one and a half second delay is way too long. The question is, is it gonna work from all the way down here? Well, maybe I need a better remote, but I'm gonna wrap up this series with that. And you guys should be proud of me because I started and finished a project all without moving on to something else. So stay tuned and hit that follow button because tomorrow I got the water heater coming for the treehouse.